All right, mate, how you doing? And welcome back to another one of my player career modes. Now, a few things have changed since my last episode. Basically, I decided I wanted to accelerate the series a bit because I want this series to show all the different clubs I play for, all the way from my climb from the bottom to the very top, you know, playing for one of the best teams in the world, maybe even West Ham if I'm lucky. What I did is I've played a little bit offline, if you like, to get my player stats up, to get a bit better at it and progress the series. I recorded it all, I just didn't face cam it all. So I'm gonna show you some of the highlights of it now and then pick up where I left off afterwards. So here's what I've been up to since the last episode. So the first goal I scored came at a very important time. It was the 89th minute, we were one nil down. A nice little move here, ends up with the ball at my feet. Didn't score the first shot, scored the rebound. You can see here I'm playing as the whole team which is something I did quite a lot in my games in between the episodes because obviously it means I can set up my player a little bit more, get him some more chances. It definitely helped. So you can see that was my sixth goal in Football League One. And I finished the game with an 8.8 .8 rating, one of my best ratings so far. One goal, pretty happy with that. Next match though, nothing really happened for me. 6.4 rating, no goals, hardly any shots at all. The game after that was almost exactly the same. Another 6.4 rating, my shooting just 25%. However, in the next game, it was a cup game actually, against Dagman and Redbridge. I do score a lovely little goal here when the ball is crossed in. I rise like a salmon, lovely header. I have scored a header before, but that was the best header I've scored so far. So I was very happy with that one. Let's look at it again. Ball comes in, bang. Neck strength, 99. Look at that. Beautiful little header from Spencer Rowan. That was my first goal in the Johnson Paint Trophy. And then we get a penalty. And because I'm playing as the whole team, I can give the penalty to my pro. He bangs it. Beautiful penalty. Why aren't I on them all the time? I should be. Great hit. 2-0. Two, two goals for me this game. Bang, that's a beauty. And it ended like that, 100% of my shots were on target. I got a 7.7 .7 rating, man of the match, two goals. Next up, a game away against Bradford. And we're on the break here. And this is probably the, one of the best, well, definitely the best individual goal I've scored with my pro. I really backed him at this point. He felt faster. He felt able to attack the space. Takes it on his own, scores it. I think he started with the ball in his own half, you know. That was really, really impressive from the young lad playing the violin there like an orchestral pro. Finished that game with a 7.9 rating, one goal, 91% passes. Next up, we were playing crew at home and the ball comes into me in the box here, lovely through ball, I bang it near post, that's a cheeky finish, I took it quickly, which is what I liked about it, you know, I didn't have a lot of thinking time, I just took the ball down and hit it in. It was a lovely finish, I must admit I really enjoyed this goal, it doesn't look the best, but the way it went in was actually really, really nice. And I get a second goal this game, you know, lovely little one-two here. Get the ball back, through ball over the top, take it down, bang it, beautiful. I'm getting real confidence with my striker now, more composure in front of goal, which I think is a really important trait for any striker. I almost get a hat-trick when I give myself a free kick and it rattles off the post. That would have been lovely, but I still got a 9.8 rating from that game. Two goals, one assist, my best performance in any one game yet, I have to say. And then away at Gillingham comes probably my best goal to date. Look at it, I win the ball, I bang it from about 28 yards out, outside the box. It's an absolute beauty, one of my favourite goals, and I'm very happy with that one. 8.2 rating, one goal, and another assist, and assists are going to be very important for me moving forward. Then I played one more game, only got a 6.6 .6 rating, wasn't my best, but the session on the whole was decent. Okay, so after those games, my player is looking like this. He's 72 rated, obviously still at Sheffield United. It's December, so we're coming up to the January transfer window. In terms of objectives, I'm smashing them really. I've already scored more than the nine I needed to. I've scored 10, so I've done that objective. I have to get five assists. I still haven't done that. I've only got three, so I need two more. My goals to shots conversion percentage is solid. My average match rating is also solid at 7.4. Let me know in the comments below how you feel about me playing offline a little bit for this series because I'm only really releasing the videos like once a week and by doing that it means I can accelerate the progress and in not too long a future we'll be you know at a better club in a higher division or would you prefer seeing every second of the action for my player let me know in the comments below meanwhile we've got a game now home against Shrewsbury let's play ball yes we've got something here we've got something here swing it in for me back post header oh how have I missed that how have I not put that in look at this Oh, spin, doggy dog. Play me. Yes. Keep the ball. Yes. And again. Find me again. Go. Hit it. Oh, almost got the assist. Still in. Still what is that? I'm definitely learning to be less selfish. You've got to have trust in your teammates, you know? But they have to earn their trust. Hit me. Back to you. You come back to me again. On the edge. Here we go. Bang it, Spinner. Bang! Oh my god, that was almost in. Here's a replay. Look at it. 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 Ah! Uh, who's he? 
On his own. On your own, mate. Here we go. Who wants it off me? Bang it in. Finish it! Someone get on these bloody crosses. Come on, let's get this goal. I'm running. I've got the pace on this guy. Come on. Come on, Spenny. On your own. On your own, son. No. Who wants it? Go back. Keep the ball. Play me again. Yes. Yes. One. Can we get a two? Can I get a remix? Yes. The possession football is lovely. And to me again. Touch. What is that touch? Oh, I've got it back. That was the worst touch I've ever seen in my life. I've just remembered this is an FA Cup replay, by the way. So if it stays level, it's going extra time. Possibly penalties. Touch. Bang. Oh, that was decent, you know. My shooting's getting better. Well, it looks like it's my first experience of extra time. Let's see if my young legs can handle it. Play me. Come on, Spenny. Finish it. Touch. Bang. Goal. Gotta be, yes. Extra time goal. Potentially the winner. Spencer Rowan bags it. Get in. Tidy finish. I mean, it was always going to go in once I had that amount of space. Easy stuff. My first goal in the FA Cup. First of many, hopefully. Yes, I've tackled him. I could be away here. I could be away. Come on, Spenny. I know you're tired. Oh my God, I'm so tired. I've been caught up. That's embarrassing. But we're parking the bus. We're parking the bus. You just got to keep the ball in the corner here. That's so good, Spencer. Who wants it off him? Lovely football. There's the final whistle, boys. We've done enough. We're through to the next round of the FA Cup. Compliments of my goal. 6.9 rating. 33% of my shots are on target. 93% of my passes landed. Not too bad. Tackling was quite poor. 12%. Okay, next match is away against MK Dons. Back in the league again now. We currently find ourselves in fourth position in a playoff spot after 22 games. We're more than halfway through the season now. 35 points. Here we go, boys. Let's do it. You see, the problem with this team is, unless we're losing, they play me up front on my own, like in the Andy Carroll role, when I'm really more of a Wayne Rooney slash Dennis Burkamp type player. Here we go. Cut back. Put it in. Bang! Oh, I wanted the assist. Play me. Play me now. Yes, Spencer is through. Well, I was looking for the assist, but the guy didn't continue his run. I am actively looking for assists over goals now, because I've hit my goals target and need to set more up. There's the final whistle, boys. It's a nil-nil draw. Not a great game for me in terms of attacking. I didn't have a single shot. I was trying to get more assists. I did make some good passes. I made a key pass, but unfortunately, no one was finishing at the end of them. I got a 5.8 rating. Not my best game by a long shot. In fact, neither team had a shot on target for the whole game. I'm being rested for the home match against Bristol. I have played a lot of games recently, so I understand why. Okay, let's simulate it. See how the Blades get on without me. Bang. They lost 3-1. That's what happens. That's what happens. Unfortunately, I can't play every game. I would if I could. Okay, I've got a new set of objectives for my next four games. I need an average rating of nine. That's high. I need to score two goals. Usually it's one. Uh, goals to shot conversion percentage, 21%. That's double what it usually is. And I need an assist. Right. I've got my work cut out for me. They've obviously noticed that I'm playing better. So now I need to do better in order to keep everyone happy. Okay, well, the last game of the episode is against Yeovil away. Hopefully, I can start things off with a goal or a cheeky assist, maybe. Let's do it. As usual, I'm playing up front on my own. The target, man. Come on, Spenny. Come on. I really wish I could take these, but unfortunately, I can't. What I can do is ask for it short. Bang. Bang. Hit it. Oh, it's a good hit. It's a good hit, but it was saved. Look at me. I'm, I'm a man on a mission. I'm picking up the ball over the shot. Bang. Bang! Oh my god, that was going in. That was going in. Play me. Play me. Come on. Oh, I've got inside easily. Finish it, Spenny. Oh, that's a weak shot. Oh, he's hit. Why did he panic and hit that? Composure, pal. Well, I've already had a hell of a lot more shots than I did last game. Last time I checked, Yeovil were bottom of League One, so you'd like to think we do well here. Oh, Spencer's done well. Bang it, Spenny. Another good shot, but deflected again. Uh-oh, my defender's lost the ball. We could be going down here. Yeah, you know, he's missed that. Blimey. I've called for the ball. It's not a bad knock, you know. Get there, Spenny. Bang! Oh, that's the first time I've tried for a really long through ball, and it worked quite well. I've had five shots already. It's not even half time. Nice football. See if you can find me again. Oh, you finish it. Oh, get there, Spenny. Yes! Get in! That's good football as well. Cheeky goal. Nicely done. That's good stuff. That's really good stuff. I get the ball. He plays it to me there. It's a cheeky through ball and a good finish with a keeper coming out at me. Look at this. Bang. Look at that. Lovely floodlights in the background. Beautiful. What football's all about. Come on. I'm a striker. If you can find me, line. That's lovely. I'm going to cross it in. Bang. Anyone on the end of that? Oh! 
Oh, it could have been a cheeky assist. There's the final whistle, boys. Solid victory away from home. I'll take it. My goal was the only goal of the game. I got a 6.9 rating, 50% shooting, 96% passing, 40% tackling. Definitely an improvement on the last match. Okay, guys, the transfer window has started and we'll be picking back up on that next episode. Before we leave, though, let's have a quick look at my pro's accomplishments. I've completed 32% of my progress. You can see the green bar is the growth I've done. The blue bar is the sort of attributes I started with. Physical is my best stat so far. I've got 77 for physical, 71 for ball skills. I'll get plus one long shots when I have five more shots on target. I'll get plus one volleys when I complete eight more games. And when I get my 25th goal, I'll get plus one for finishing. I've beat players off a dribble 47 times. When I've done it 75 times, I'll get plus one star skill moves. Currently, I've got three star skill moves, which is probably realistic, to be honest. I'm not exactly Ronaldinho in real life. Well, not really. Okay, that's where we're going to leave this episode. I hope you've enjoyed it. Let me know your thoughts and what I said at the start of the episode about whether you want me to continue offline to build the progress of the career and then come back at different points or if you want to see every second of every minute I play, let me know that as well. Drop a like on the video if you've enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new. I'll see you on the next one. Don't go changing.